keep working hard, and if you're not getting to do what you love now and make a living, then one day you will be able to. Well, this UT English major is graduating on Saturday and was able to pay his rent through school and pave a future for himself through pottery. How cool is that? 10 News reporter Shannon Smith spent the morning in the pottery studio with Peter Cates and Shannon. He says his pottery business really started by accident. You know, it really did. He never set out a goal to start selling his work, but Peter took a pottery class at UT his freshman year on a whim when a friend asked him to join out. Turns out he's really good at it and he's using his English degree to influence that work and his post-grad life. You're ready? Yeah. Great. Ready or not, Knoxville native Peter Cates will be walking across the stage receiving his college diploma on Saturday, a feat he thanks in part to a talent he discovered by accident freshman year, pottery. You know, I'd taken art classes in high school, but we didn't do ceramics in it, so, um, and I wasn't very good. That changed quickly. He picked up pottery faster than his classmates, and then some of them wanted to buy his work. $10 mug here and there, and then my mugs got better, so they became $20 mugs here and there, and then people started asking for more commissioned work. Now, four years later, and a lot of pieces sold. Probably around 200, 300. Kate's used the business to pay his rent, and to give him some savings for his life post-graduation. Being able to do something I love and get paid to do it is a real, a real privilege. I'm very, very lucky. But it's never been about the money. Kate is an English major and says his studies have an impact on his style as a potter. But I learned about aesthetic appeal. I learned about how um, one symbol can have meaning behind it, and it brings a lot more depth to my pottery. Kate wants to keep writing and keep making pottery when he moves to New York this summer. He wrote his first play this past year, inspired by his life and his craft. UT All Campus Theater produced it this spring. As he gets ready to move away from home for the first time, it's bittersweet, just like the last line of his play. All of that meticulous time and focus that you put into this one beautiful thing, and you'll have to let it go. You'll have to let her go and go on living. Well, very well put. Now, Kate is not just a potter and a playwright. He's also done undergraduate research and served as a student president of the Chancellor's Honors Program. After graduation, he's going to backpack through Eastern Europe for a while before moving up to the Big Apple. Back to you guys. Impressive. I mean, what other word can you say than impressive? All right. Thanks for sharing your story with us, Shannon. Absolutely. Appreciate it. Renaissance man for sure.